We're here with head women's track and field coach Matt Lee as he enters his ninth season at the helm of the Regals. Coach, you had a young group competing last year. Now they have some experience under their belt. Talk about the team dynamic with those returners while still bringing in a good amount of newcomers. I think it's going to be a, a big key, uh, especially with a few of those returners that we have coming back. Um, one being obviously Ali Hadley in the throws and Amanda Hamilton in the sprints and jumps. They pretty much have a couple of those big areas on our team covered, which is, is nice to have when you have three quarters of your team covered by two superstars um, to help lead the way in terms of what I'm more meaning. Uh, along with a bunch of freshmen that we have and even a bunch of sophomores. That's really our team. Yes, we're made up of a lot of returners, but we're still very young in terms of collegiate track and field experience with the freshman class this year and a bunch of the freshmen from last year that are now sophomores. Um, I think it's going to be a good gel. I'm excited about this year's team. Uh, I think they're going to be good together. Uh, and I think the leadership of the upperclassmen, not only um, track and field terms, but just off the track leadership is going to be really key for us. And uh, what will be some of the strengths that you see with this team this year? I think we got a lot of strengths in different areas. I don't think we're solid. I don't think we're great in one single area. Obviously, with that being said, I mean, Amanda and the triple, Allie and the javelin, um, obviously those are huge strengths. Um, but in terms of being solid in like one single area and lower in another, I think we're pretty solid in every single area of the track and field program on the women's side this year. Um, I think we're deep in every area, which we have not been in the past. I feel like we got vaulters and jumpers and high jumpers and um, sprinters, hurdlers, throwers. We definitely picked up a few more throwers, which was really key for our women's program this year, not just having one or two throwers out there, but now having four or five female throwers. Um, so I think the, the experience and the depth on the women's side is really going to help us a lot, not only in the conference meet, but heading on into the national championships. And so what are some goals and expectations with that heading into the season? Um, obviously on the women's side we've set the bar pretty high the last two or three years. Uh, we've brought home a significant amount of national champions, uh, All-Americans, uh, top 10, top 15 finishes on the national side. Um, so our goal on the women's side is to win a conference title. I mean it's always to win a Sky Conference Championship and then continue that on to a top 10 finish and, and always going after as many points as we can at the national championships. And I really believe that we have two athletes on the team this year that can go and be individual national champions this year. Um, I, I think Amanda and Allie are, are very experienced at the national level, having this be their fourth year, and if they qualify, it would be their fourth national championship. Um, I think it's going to be fun to see what they can do out there and, and take on their senior se season. Thanks, Coach, and good luck this year. Thank you.